My art is about positivity. I want the colors to be inspiring and dynamic and make people wake up a little bit. I want the painting to give a sense of freedom and light and possibility. I grew up in Alaska and I accidentally fell in love with a very hairy Greek that brought me here to Belgium with his career and I fell in love with Belgium. There are some incredible parks, beautiful scenery, and I have to paint everything. I've always had the sketchbook on me, and over time, my travels have brought me through Europe, and I was able to collect landscape drawings that I could bring together in a collection that shows my journey as an artist. So, I would say my journey is going through my sketchbooks and culminating in a cherry-picked collection of those landscapes. Growing up in Alaska, I practiced portraiture, so I was doing faces more than anything else. And when I moved to Barcelona when I was younger, I started doing architectural drawings, and I was really shocked that buildings don't move after drawing people for so long. <laughs> and now I get this amazing opportunity to paint portraits often. We're here in Art Base Gallery, which is in the center of Brussels, right at the heart of the city. And we're here for my collection of paintings, which are of my journey from Greece to Belgium. The collection that you're seeing here today is called Immensities. And the reason I titled that was after doing all my sketches and preparing these canvases, the global coronavirus pandemic occurred and I suddenly had to be painting in my very tiny apartment. And I realized that everyone needed a window that looked out on a view that gives them a sense of freedom. Some of the techniques that I've used for this exhibition in particular is a collection of really hard work color theory methods that I researched and then it took me a really long time to mix colors that suit my personal color palette. I wanted an entirely bespoke rainbow. I also got to explore antique markets in Athens and antique markets here in Brussels. And I collected beautiful antique frames and I painted on the frame to allow the viewer some sort of sculptural experience that brings them even deeper into the painting. The thing that I love about the community that I've become engaged with is that it's a rich tapestry of multiculturalism. I don't feel that I'm excluded from Belgian society because it's a crossroad on the object level, on the architectural level, on the human level. 